Hey, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode of Gentleman's Pick. My name is Ryan, and today I want to talk about another Bramon watch. It is the Bramon MB3 10 year anniversary. As always, Bramon's aviation watch carry amazing stories behind them. And last time I talked about the Bramon H4 Hercules, which was to commemorate Hughes era aircraft. And this time around, it is the Martin Baker groundbreaking invention of the ejection seat. In 2009, Bramont introduced the MB1 to the market and the watch was designed in collaboration with and tested by Martin Baker, specifically to be able to withstand the violent shock from an aircraft ejection. The MB1 was um, specifically and exclusively made for pilots that have ejected only, and MB2 is the civilian version of that watch. The MB3, however, was introduced in 2015 and the watch contained a GMT hand and, and substituted the roto click inner bezel with a 24 hour bezel and in 2019 the 10 year anniversary of their martin baker partnership bramon put out a white dialed mb3 giving it a new titanium case and an engraved ejection seat on the case back and a danger ejection seat uh, batch on the dial at six o'clock Contrary to popular opinion, I don't think the batch is silly at all. Some reviews online on the internet think that this batch has the same purpose as the warning sticker on a hatchet or the tag on a Ducati, which is to be discarded ASAP, like no one would care to read it or look at it. But I don't think so, because I think the batch on this watch is what made this watch not just a tribute to uh, the Martin Baker's invention, not just telling people the origin of the design. It's almost like the seat itself transformed into a watch, like how transformers turn into cars. It is an insignia or a, or a mark to tell people that the seat is the main focus here. That's why they added the batch on it, just like the seat, right? And I really like the brush case here. It really blends into the leather strap. And one thing to keep in mind is the sturdiness of this watch. As I said, this watch has to withstand the pressure and the G-force from an ejecting seat. So a normal impact or drop test won't suffice. The watch is at 43 millimeters and is priced at $5,600 and is unfortunately limited edition. But the MB3, not the anniversary version, is available, is available now on Bramon.com. So definitely go check this watch out. This is the buy it for the story kind of watches. So thank you for tuning in and I'll see you in the next episode.